Welcome back, lovelies. I know you've seen by the thumbnail what today is. You specifically, a few of you asked me to review this, so how could I not? We have the Wet n Wild Saved by the Bell collection. We have the entire collection. This is what it looks like. It says Kelly loves Zach, has pictures of them all, the Bayside Tigers logo. It looks like a locker. Definitely is not a locker. Oh, here we go on the side. We have all of them. I don't remember all their names. I know Zach, Kelly, Screech. Oh my gosh, I remember those. I don't remember her that well. But I remember all of these just, I don't remember her that well. But look at this, guys. This is how it came, literally falling apart because it's a cardboard. It's got like books. But we're gonna take it all out now because this thing is falling apart. I hope nothing falls out, but here's everything that came in the collection that we're gonna look at and swatch today. If you would like to see that, then please consider subscribing below. Ring the bell so you know when the next one comes. Leave me a like and please leave me a comment. I answer all of them and I love talking to you guys. But now, with that very quick intro, let's get into this. I'm going to show it up close one more time and then I'm gonna take everything out. Came with a lot of stuff that we're gonna have to swatch. So let me get it all out of here and I'll be right back. You guys, I have got to get a better chair. This thing is killing my back. Well, maybe that'll help. Maybe I just had to. I bought a back brace type thing. Maybe I just had to fix it. Anyways, I was floored when I took the brushes out. Look, they're in a old school looking phone the antenna for all you youngsters that don't know this is how cell phones first look they were it's literally real size like look at this it's real size ah, that is crazy but that is just that is nuts that phones used to literally be this big and now they're this thin <laughs> anyways let's get over that real quick first off i was not going to order this collection because i just ordered all of the collection four palettes four face palettes or i should say four eye palettes four face palettes four lip sets um a face serum and a setting powder from like the cocoa cherry and all that but you guys asked so i had to come through for you and i got it now we're going to swatch everything we are not going to do it because i have a full face of makeup so we're not going to do it on our face sorry but let's start with the non-makeup item before i show that to you I do have the receipt here. I paid $69.99, $5 tax, no shipping. So all together, I paid $75.23 for all of this. Keep that in mind. Now we got this little bag. Oh my gosh, how cute is this bag? Let me get it, let me get it like filled out. Do you guys see this little bag? It doesn't have much structure to it, but it's so tiny. It's like the size of my head. Look, it's as long as my hand. The length is as long as my hand. Like you could actually fit a decent amount of stuff in here. You can fit the palette in there. I wonder if you could fit everything in there. Oh. I'm excited, don't mind me. But look at it, it has all of the designs, remember the cafe? This is what the walls look like. It says Saved by the Bell. It says Wet and Wild on it. Look at the tag. I'm gonna put this in the giveaway bin for someone because I wouldn't use it. I'm gonna see if everything fits in it first. So let's start with the brushes. We got this, which has brushes in it. Once I figure out how to open it, it just, look at that. It actually closes back. That's too cute. So I don't think there's anything in the back. No, that's just for looks. I'm gonna give this to my nieces. They'll have a blast with it. 
thinking they got a real cell phone, not knowing it's back from the film like the 80s. I don't know if I can get the brushes out though. Go. I'm gonna put that back together and definitely give it to my nieces. So here are the three brushes. I'm glad I got these brushes, I'm not gonna lie. They are adorable. We got All right, they say on them Wet and Wild and Saved by the Bell. They do not tell what kind of brush they are. This is just a little blender brush. Look at that design. So cute. Then we have an angled brush that I would use for like contour. Again, whoops, upside down. Wet and Wild, Saved by the Bell. And then we have just a little packer brush. Those are too cute. Next we have this. It has Screech on it. It says, Home of the Tigers Kabuki Brush. Rest in peace, Screech. He passed away. He, he played an epic role on that show, I won't lie. I hate throwing all this packaging away, but I can't keep it. I ain't got enough room. Really got enough room for all my makeup, let alone all the packaging. That is so cute. Just a, and these are so soft, you guys. I have always stood by wet and wild brushes. You can literally get wet and wild brushes at the 99 cent store. I'm putting them in with my bling brushes and my other brushes. There's the kabuki. Then we, let's look at this. We have a vanilla rest or no i'm vanilla it does not say vanilla it shows how blind i am it says want to wrestle want to wrestle setting spray does it smell does it have a scent nope just smells like setting spray so let's check out shake it up check out that mister oh that mister is so fine i will try some of that right now Oh no, that smells good. I know you guys are gonna think I'm weird when I say this because I said it smelled good. At Halloween time, inside of Party City, when they have their Halloween costumes out, that's exactly what this smells like. I don't know how to explain it to you any other way, but that's what it smells like to me. Identical, it's smells like Halloween. I don't know why it does and I love it. So we have that and that mister is amazing. That feels good. Next we're getting into the makeup. We have the Bayside Cheerleading Mascara. Yes, all three of them were cheerleaders. I am a nerd. I remember her. How could I say that I don't freaking remember her? I do. With the big crimped hair. It was like a blondish brown. Just she looked like somebody else on the big packaging. So I'm like, I don't remember her. But then I looked up close and I do. I apologize to her. I do remember her. But anyways, we have the mascara. Look at this packaging. So cute. It all says limited edition, by the way. So if you want this, I would grab it before it sells out. And then it's gone for good. So here's what it looks like. It's just a wet and wild mascara. There was no seal. Ooh, I like that brush. It's not super thin, but I like it. I will keep that. I was gonna say I'll give that to you guys. I don't need it, but I'm gonna keep that. Now, we have three lip kits, three face kits, and an eyeshadow palette. Okay, now we're gonna do the three face duos. Start with the darkest, which is called It's All Right, and it is Slater and Jesse. Ah! I remembered she says you nacho pig and he says oink oink baby I remember that I used to love it so much and there is a divider piece in the middle
That is the first swatch. We're gonna do two on each. And here's our second. That's a baby pink and it's actually really pretty. This one is Jessie's side and that's really pretty. So there's, it's all right. Sorry, I had to look, very pretty. Then we're gonna do Screech and Lisa. Lisa, that was her name, freaking Lisa, I remember. Theirs is called Nerd Alert, and he says, pick you up at seven-ish, and she says, sorry, Screech. Right there, him and her, him and her. Ooh, that feels like a highlight, like a deeper highlight. There's the first swatch. I'm, this one's a lot softer than that one was, that's for sure. That is beautiful. So, that is Nerd Alert. And then we have hashtag relationship goals with Kelly and Zach. They were just the best couple ever. Didn't Zach kiss Jesse, or am I remembering something that didn't happen? Let me know in the comments if you watched this and you remember that, or am I remembering something else? But anyways, Kelly says, you're crazy, and Zach says, about you. You're crazy and about you. I had swatched it before I told you. This looks like a highlight I would wear. Now we'll do our second layer. I love that. That's a beautiful coral color. And there is hashtag relationship goals. So there's all three. Very pretty. So that was the three glowy face duos, which is what they're called. Now we're going to do the three lips. I thought I was recording and I wasn't. So the first two are already out of their packaging. This is um, Kelly's. So here's the lip liner. It's just like an old fashioned pencil. Very cute. Do it like this so you can actually see the color. Very pretty. Sorry guys, I gotta lean forward. My back is killing me. And then this, look at the packaging, the all white hardware, so cute. I literally thought I was recording for like 20 minutes and I wasn't. And I also love how, you see how the, the applicator, it's just flat and wide and it like, it moves, look. And by the way, these are plumping glosses. And then that one is Kelly's. Now we're doing Lisa's. Hers is more pinker than, or I should say hers more is a, hers more is a, no. Hers is more of a mauvey pink, where Kelly's is more of a brighter pink. So of course, the lip pencil first. Guys, these lip pencils are so creamy. I like Lisa's lip pencil color better. Same packaging. And these, did I already say they're plumping? If I didn't, they are plumping. Let me do a second layer of hers. That's as dark as it gets. And then last, we have Jessie's. I realized I wasn't recording by time I got to opening hers, thank God. If I would have did the eyeshadow palette and everything, I would have literally cried with how bad my back is hurting. But I don't care how bad it's hurting. I want to get this video out because you guys asked me to review this. So here is Jessie's. Although I don't remember Jessie wearing such a peaky brown color, but maybe I'm just crazy. Because that could definitely be. No, I do not remember her wearing such a brown lip. But that's okay. And then her gloss pumping gloss and they have some good pigment and 
and there's Jessie's. So we have Lisa, or no, I'm sorry. We have Kelly, Lisa, Jessie. They're all actually really pretty combinations. So those are the three combos that we got. Now we have one thing left. Piece de resistance, the eyeshadow palette. It looks like a locker with the red lines for the vents. It has everybody. We have Kelly, Zach, Screech, Slater, Jesse, and Lisa. It just took me a minute to remember. And it says squad goals right there. It says limited edition here and it has like the little combination lock. Get ready for a night out with your squad with this shadow palette featuring 15 hyper pigmented shades in a mix of buttery soft mattes, sparkly shimmers, gleaming satins, and a self-adhering multi-dimensional glitter. And then it says the names. So let's open it up and see if they're right about that self-adhering glitter. Lord, that took too long. But how cute is this? Look, we have a heart with a J, or I mean a Z and a K in it. Oh, the Max, that was the name of the diner. And then this one is embossed with Go Tigers. I don't know if you be able to see it. We have three, six, nine, 15 shades to swatch. So let's get to swatching. Seems like we have seven mattes. We have four, five satins, a glitter. I, I don't know, we have a lot going on. Ooh. That glitter kind of feels like the glitter from the Glammy Air palette. This one like how smooth it feels. You guys, I'm doing it over here. It'll be a lot easier to see if I do it over here. So I wiped them all off the other arm so I can do them over here. I have to dip in twice for that glitter or there's no way I'm gonna get it. dipping in twice to all of these because they're so light you could barely see them on my skin but they're there let me get some more of those Okay, they're buildable, that's good. Definitely buildable. Next three. Ooh, for being a light blue, shows up good. Ooh, that's pretty. So is that. Okay, this palette's not doing too bad. At first I was like, ah, but it, it's, it's redeeming itself, at least with swatches. Next three. Okay, blue, coming through. Oh, wow. That matte brown was like, oh, I'm not playing. And the last three. And I also moved it because being on the inside of my arm, if I'd have got that on my white shirt, it would have been hell. Okay, black. Oh, I'm happy that gray worked. I love gray. Okay, here's what it looks like after all the swatches. Look at the the Z and the K. It doesn't even look like I touched it. Or the, um, the Max. Okay, now that I've swatched them, I'm gonna go through and read all the names. There are three here. This one, this one, and this one. Just so you know, because I know they're hard to see. We have Time Out, Ditch Day, Malibu Sands, the next three. Friends Forever, Sweetheart Dance, Hot Sunday, the next three. 
Preppy, you, me, prom. I'm so excited. Next three. Hall Pass, Go Bayside, Detention, and the last three. Checkmate, Beat Valley, Hey, Hey, Hey. So there you go, guys. Now, I am sorry to rush out of here, but my back can't take anymore. These were the, these two, these two, and these two were the three glow palettes. There were the three lip liners with the glosses. Here was the palette. That is a beautiful glitter, but it don't seem so easy to work with. We had the setting spray, these three brushes, and the kabuki brush. And that was everything. So please let me know in the comments what you thought about this collection. What was your favorite piece? This is Kelly, Lisa, and Jessie. It's All Right was the first one. Nerd Alert is the second one. Hashtag Relationship Goals was the third one. So which was your favorite lip liner and lip gloss duo? And which was your favorite glow duo? There is the palette one last time. And I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please consider subscribing. Ring that bell so you know when the next one comes. And leave me a like if you enjoyed this video. I will see you lovelies in the next one. Bye.